Stop 222, John Coffey, Curator of American and Modern Art. This painting was never intended for a museum, but was meant to be an heirloom of the family of Sir William Pepperell. His son, the little boy between the father and mother in, in this picture, predeceased his parents. So the painting descended in the family of the girl on the right, the youngest daughter, Harriet, who married into the Palmer family of Leicestershire, England. And it remained in Wanlip Hall, the Palmer family's stately home, until some descendant of the family redecorated the hall and sold off a number of things, including the Copley portrait. The painting was bought in the 1930s by William Randolph Hearst, who was decorating a castle in Wales he had just recently purchased. And when Hearst died, the castle and its contents were sold, and the painting came back on the New York art market where it was bought by North Carolina in 1952. Since it has been in Raleigh, the painting has been a pilgrimage site for descendants of the Pepperell family who are worldwide. And we've recently had a visit by one young family whose kids look as if they could have walked right out of the picture.